Yeah, the first warnings about a resurgence of roofies went out late last spring, and it's not just bars, but college parties where you need to keep your guard up. You can't see them, smell them, or taste them, and that's why you need to be vigilant so someone doesn't slip a roofie in your drink. Boston police sounded the alarm a few months ago that drink spiking is again on the rise, and colleges like Emerson are also alerting students as they return to campus. We're both journalism students, so we we were aware of it, of it last semester before our summer. Yeah, it's really scary. I think it's, it's like really messed up. We're international students. It happens all over the world. Like yeah. it's not, it's not, it's nothing new. Rufi comes from the word rohypnol. Sold in some countries as a sleeping pill, this drug is illegal in the U.S. because it can cause a person to become extremely drowsy, disoriented, confused, and even to black out. And predators can slip something in your drink in a heartbeat. It's just right. like pickpocketing. Same pace, yeah. the same thing. You're right, cl you're really close to you, and you don't even notice. Wow. You just always got to be safe at all times. I think that's a big thing, even just being in the city. Like, always be with a buddy. Like, never go out alone. Yeah. Good advice. Authorities also warning students to never accept drinks from a stranger. If you did not see your drink poured, don't drink it. Never leave your drink unattended. Avoid sharing drinks with others. And keep your hand covered over your drink when you're not looking at it. The Boston police are warning students and young professionals to keep your guard up about roofies and call 911 if you think you or a friend has been targeted. At Emerson, I'm Mary Salatna, WCVB News Center 5.